thank you for your question. Uh, Google has recently, uh, August 2019, has uh, put in a, a new uh, option for teachers uh, to uh, check for unsighted content and un and uh, plagiarism, and uh, that is uh, something called an originality report. And so we'll walk through uh, the steps that a teacher would take and uh, what that means for students. All right, so what we'll do here is, is uh, in our Google Classroom, uh, I will get you to take a look at uh, the Classwork tab. And this works when you create assignments. All right, it does not show up for material or questions, but when you go to assignment, uh, what you'll see in the bottom right hand corner now is this ability to check for originality reports. So uh, when this is checked, it means that uh, the student can, uh, when, when they have uh, an assignment and they use a Google Doc, <clears throat> they can run up to three originality reports per assignment. And those uh, three originality reports are private to the student um, that they can see. And then when they turn in the uh, document, uh, the Google Classroom runs another report, and that is a report that the teacher can see. Okay, and then if uh, the student unsubmits, what happens is that uh, they can then run another report, and then they can uh, resubmit, and the teacher will see the newly um, run report. Okay, so let's take a look at how this works. So first off, We'll create a title here. All right. So please write a paragraph. Okay. <clears throat> and so originality report is on, and I am going to assign. All right. So here it is. It's in my Google Classroom. And now I'll go in as a student so you can see what it looks like as a student. Okay, we're in as a student and I can see that uh, the originality report is here and it says, please write a paragraph on dolphins. So I'm going to, uh, yes, thank you for, for this. It's actually telling us where this is. Originality report has been turned on. So, okay, uh, I am going to create a brand new Google Doc. And through the magic of Wii Video, I will quickly copy and paste a few items uh, from the internet, and then I'll type uh, a couple sentences at the very end here. All right, so just trying to plagiarize the best I can. Here we go. Okay, so we have uh, a few things that I have copied and then um, something that I've quickly typed up here. And so what I'll do now is uh, I am going to run a report. Okay, so I'm going to close this out, go back to my Google Classroom, and we'll notice on the right-hand side it says originality reports. And so I'm going to run this report. It says that I have three available. So I'm going to run the report. And you'll see it running. Originality report, 63%. Okay, so it looks like it's done now. And so if I want to view it, I have to click on this right here. Notice it opens up a new tab. And it says that there's eight flagged passages. <clears throat> so it tells me what has been flagged. Okay, so you can see it even tells me where I have copied this from. And the top match. So it has done a really good job of finding Wikipedia. Oh, and then it did find this other one. Yes, and that was the site that I copied it from. And let's take a look. And it did not find anything about the things that I typed. Okay. 
So when I click on uh, this button here, it actually says that 64% has been flagged. So I wouldn't say that that is absolutely accurate. It seems like a lot more to me, but um, at least it does give some kind of range. All right, from the teacher's point of view, I will take a look at the originality report. I'll see that I have two people have hand this in. And so I will click on the student. Notice that the right hand side here says eight flagged passages. All right, this is from the originality report. All right, so I can see what the, from the Google Doc. When I click on the eight flagged passages, I get a report. I can click on this. I also have the option to see what percentage. And I can scroll through all the, the passages that have been matched. So that is how the originality report uh, works. And again, uh, in your Google Classroom, you will find that option under classwork when you create an assignment, and you can click on originality reports. Thanks for watching.